In this video we discuss chordomas. Chordomas originate from the malignant transformation of notochordal cells. Their most frequent location in the skull base is the sphenooccipital synchondrosis of the clivus, followed by the basiocciput and petrous apex. Tumors away from the midline are considerably less common. Chordomas are locally invasive and uncommonly metastasize. They usually present with pain and lower cranial nerve pulses. CT with bone window settings. Centrally located. Well circumscribed. A destructive lytic lesion with marginal sclerosis. Expansile soft tissue mass. Hyperattenuating in relation to the adjacent neural axis. Bone destruction and calcification. Soft tissue mass is often disproportionately large relative to the bony destruction. Moderate to marked enhancement. MRI features are intermediate to low signal intensity on T1W. Very high signal intensity on T2 images. Frequently containing septae of low signal, which gives a characteristic soap bubble appearance and the solid components show variable, but often marked, contrast enhancement. Fat suppressed T1-weighted images are particularly helpful for demonstrating the extent of the tumor and distinguishing pathological enhancement from the high signal of adjacent clival fat. Partial encasement or displacement of the intracranial vessels is common, but arterial narrowing or stenoses are rare. MI and CTA can be used to show the relationship of the tumor to the surrounding vessels. The differential diagnosis includes chondrosarcoma, metastasis, and nasopharyngeal carcinoma. If you like the video, you can like it, comment it, and share it with your friends. If you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe and click the bell button.